let's talk about is the father's love because in john 3 16 he says for god so loved the world that he gave his only his one and only begotten son that whosoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life this just explains the simple fact that for you to believe in god you have everlasting life he gave his son and actually today's um is easter monday so we've all gone to church and known the experience what jesus did on easter is dead for us and he died on the cross of calvary for us so what we are always doing what we always celebrating on easter is just more like a remembrance remembrance of what he did but he died and he died once and that means that once and for all your sins have been washed clean your sins have been wiped away so there is no new sin there's no new death again so we're celebrating the remembrance of what he did and that is what is going to like this should make us happy this should make us rejoice and celebrate because this one sacrifice this one sacrifice he did made us blameless made us sinless it made us righteous and now we have a new life in Christ Jesus we have eternal life and this eternal life this eternal is not like only day or that is going to end all you know in a flash of a light or in a minute and the life really is eternal for God so loved the world God loves us so much he said nothing can separate us from the love of God he just say no tribulation nothing as long as you've confessed Jesus as your Lord and Savior, you would return. You've returned to God. You've returned to Him. Nothing can remove His love from you again. Yes, you can say, does it mean that I should continue singing? No. What it means right here is, no matter if you if you sin, you will still the beloved child of a beloved father. All you need to do is just meet Him. Just talk to Him like a son. We are an adopt we are adopted son. I said Jesus is the first hair. The first hair, the first hair among brethren, the first son among brethren. So all you need to do is just go say, Lord, I, I have sinned against you. Okay, the thing I did was bad, I'm so sorry about it. But that doesn't mean he doesn't love you. That doesn't mean he has pushed you away from his presence. No. His presence tabernacles with you. As long as you have the Holy Spirit in you, you carry the presence of God everywhere you go. So the love of the Father, Revelations chapter 4 and chapter 5, shows us the throne room. Where um, we were asking who would go for us in the Lamb. That looked like he has been slain, took the scroll. And opened it. He took the fall for us. He took the pain for us. So why would um something God Jesus has given to you when he said he had given it to you eternally? Why would you say you don't have it? It's more like uh, you having a child. And because your child did something that's bad. When your child goes out there and they ask you, you are the child of, um, you are the child of the Oluwatobis. And the child say, no, I am not Oluwatobi. Why? I am scared. I'm not even sure if I'm an Oluwatobi again. Why? Because I've done something wrong to my father. His name is Lilith. Nothing removes. He did something wrong. So, it's still him. It's still God. It's still the son of the father. Look at that of the prodigal son. The parable of Jesus gave the parable of the prodigal son, parable, parable of the 99. The love of the father is eternal for us. And this John 3 16 is for everybody, it's for all in the world. He gave us the freedom of that. That is what Christianity does. Christianity gives you a freedom to choose what you want. And choose life. Choose the life of God. 
Choose the life eternal. Choose glory. Choose the love of God. Who will want to choose hatred when there is love already being showered on you? That love brought you from your mother's womb. That love was there. That love molded you. That love brought you out. That love brought you to this moment. And that love is still waiting for you to come and say, Father, I have sinned and I have come and I have returned. And when you come into this love, it cocoons you and it is love eternal. It doesn't 